welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question that says, if i plus 1 upon 1 minus i to raise to the power m is equal to 1, then find the least integral value of m. Now as we know, iota square is equal to minus 1. This implies iota cube is equal to iota square into iota which is equal to minus iota. Similarly, iota 4 can be written as iota square into iota square which is equal to minus 1 into minus 1. This is equal to 1. Hence, we can say that iota raised to the power 4 is equal to 1. By using these few ideas, we will try to find the integral value of m for which this is satisfied. So, this is a key idea. Let us now begin with the solution. And here we are given 1 plus iota upon 1 minus iota raised to the power m is equal to 1. So we have 1 plus iota upon 1 minus iota and we will try to write it in the form of a complex number a plus iota b. So multiplying the numerator and denominator by the conjugate of 1 minus iota which is 1 plus iota we have in the denominator 1 square minus iota square and in the numerator we have 1 plus iota whole square which is further equal to 1 plus 2 iota plus iota square and in the denominator we have 1 square minus of minus 1. Since iota square is equal to minus 1, therefore in the numerator we have 2 iota and in the denominator we have 2. Since here again iota square is minus 1, so minus 1 plus 1 cancels out and we are left with i. So we have 1 plus iota upon 1 minus iota is equal to i. And we are given that 1 plus iota upon 1 minus iota raised to the power m is equal to 1. This implies i raised to the power m is equal to 1 and we have to find the least integral value of m. And by a key idea we know that i raised to the power 4 is equal to 1. This implies m is equal to 4. That is the least integral value of m is equal to 4. So this completes the solution. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.